Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. I said praise the Lord. Are we ready to praise God today? Amen. Amen. Let's hear it. Let's hear it from God this morning. Amen. If somebody loves the Lord today, would you stand up and give him a, a clap off for you today? Say, so God, you're awesome. You're magnificent. You're glorious. Come on, we can do better than that. We can do better than that. He's been good to you this week. He's, he's been proud of his love on you. Lord God, His grace upon your life. Come on, somebody, give God praise today. Somebody give an offering of praise. Say, Lord God, I love you today. You're worthy to be praised, oh God. We love you today, Lord. We exalt you today, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Just start giving them the high praise right now. Just start giving them the highest praise right now. Somebody say, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Just give them the highest praise right now. We don't need the instruments right now. We just use our voices right now. And God, you're awesome. You're glorious. Start looking at the praises right now. We need to get warmed up. This is the issue is we get warmed up. We need to get warmed up right now. Just start saying, God, I love you. You're so beautiful. You're so magnificent. You're so glorious. You're so good to me in my life. Come on, somebody. Just start lifting up the, the name of Jesus today. Just start focusing on his goodness. Just start focusing on what he's done for you. Just invite the Holy Spirit into your life, into your heart right now. Invite him to fill you up. Invite him with the power of your grace. Come on, somebody. Just start lifting him up. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Bless the Lord, all oh, my soul. And all that is within me, bless his holy name, O oh God. Father, we thank you, O oh God, that this is the hour that belongs to you, O oh God. We are setting our hearts and minds upon you. We want the mind of the Spirit today, Lord. We want to hear what you are speaking to us, oh God. We thank you, oh God, that you have invited us into your presence, Lord God. We come boldly into the throne of grace right now, oh God, to obtain mercy, to obtain grace in our time of need. Hallelujah. We thank you, Heavenly Father, that you have invited us together, Lord, to offer up praises to your name. You're worthy to be praised. So right now, we just Center our minds on you. We cast all our cares upon you, Lord Jesus. We spin hard, we get distracted, we've turned away from you, but today, Lord, we're 
turn it back to you right now. Yes. 11 o'clock. We're turning our hearts to you. We're giving you glory. We're giving you praise. We're setting our compass to true north, which is you, O oh God. Our hearts are set upon you. And we deserve the highest praise. Today we'll give it to you with all that we have. We'll listen to your word today. Because your word is bread to our to our lives. We're hungry people. Holy Spirit, we ask you to pour out your water upon us today. We're about to saturate us today. We give you thanks today in the name of Jesus and all last people say.
Psalm 91. Says this, it says, those who live in the shelter of the Most High will find rest in the shadow of the Almighty. This I declare about the Lord. He is my refuge and my place of safety. He is my God. And I trust in Him. How many want to be under the shadow of the Father? How many want to be in the shadow of the Father? And nothing can come against us when we're under the shadow of our fall.
Um, this was uh, something that's constant. What I'm doing now is that I'm constantly trying to put myself in the verses of scripture. Like sometimes it says yourself, so then I just put it myself so I can take ownership of what's being said. And um, one of the things I read was in Colossians it says, Close myself with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. Then it continues and says, Be even tempered, content with second place, quick to forgive an offense, forgive. As quickly, as completely as the master forgave you, regardless of what else you put on, wear love. It's your basic all-purpose garments. Never be without it. This is Colossians 3, that's the MSG version. Just wanted to share that. And so let me go quickly to the announcements. All right, so we want to welcome you, obviously. Praise God that you're here. Um, we also just want to remind you about the three ways to give. All right, we went over that. Please, guys, be, um, you know, continually following your, your offering. That's an act of worship. Amen? And what's happening today? Today's the last day to get your tax forms. So please, guys, if you haven't gotten your tax forms, go into the cafe today and get that. And what is uh, happening this week? All right, today, after service, we're having uh, lunch with the pastors. Amen? So I believe... Is that downstairs? Downstairs. downstairs. Amen. Um, we also are having life groups this week. Anybody part of life groups? Yeah. Amen. How's it been so far? Yeah. yeah right? So, amen. Um, you still have time to join. Please, if you if you guys are having a hard day, there's uh, plenty of life groups. There are some forms there. You can see what days you can come in. All right. Also, uh, coming is the Young Life Campaigners. Uh, for teens, that's this Friday at 4.30 p.m. That's also weekly. Also, we have the Girl Talk. That's this Wednesday at 6.30. Amen? All right. And a mental. All right. Living Like Worship. Amen? That's coming this Saturday at 6 p.m. That's 6 p.m. Yeah, 6 p.m. All right. Um, and I actually saw that, thank God. All right, All right. and I think Stephanie, is Stephanie Sweet on the dance? Oh. All right. Hello, guys. Um, my name is Stephanie. I'm one of the leaders from the dance ministry, Sweet Aroma. We just want to let you guys know next Saturday we're opening up um, registrations for anybody who's interested in joining the, the dance ministry. Um, the orientation will start at 9.30 to 12.30. It is open to anybody who wants to know what the dance ministry is about, and not only those who want to join. We will have, we will share each of us, each of the members, we will share our testimony um, of what God has done through and in us in the dance ministry, and that there will be worship of uh, based on healing and praise. Um, there will be refreshments as well, which is always a plus. Um, yeah, and we, if you guys have any questions today, we'll be in the primary room after service, and John wants to share a little bit of the testimony. It's been amazing for me, so even if you've never thought about dancing, you're like, no, this isn't for me, try it out, um, come out next Saturday. Um, I took a leap of faith, and it's been amazing, it's been transforming my life, taking me out of my comfort zone. Um, <laughs> but it's amazing, just, you know, come out and see what's in Amen. Please don't be like me, just come from the freshness. Be a part of it. Amen. So, uh, we have our annual meeting um, of worship. This is uh, February 21st at 7 15. We will also have refreshments at 6. Um, but we'll be voting for the deacons. Uh, then there's Lou, I think it does Lou. Joe Labrill and Yolanda. So that's coming up on Twitter first. So in lieu of that, please keep them in prayer. I mean, it's tough to be leaders, but um, you know, even in the house of God, it's hard. Really hard. But you know what? If we have a powerful church praying, you know, where we can overcome. Amen? Amen. So, um, we have a couple's breakfast. Amen to couples. Yeah. Coming the 22nd.
and that is at 9.30 a.m. to 11.30. Okay, and that is Minister Antonio and his wife Melissa. Amen? So this coming Saturday, the 20, like the 20 second. Also, a uh, new generation, young adults retreat. Amen. That is um, March 13th to the 14th, you have to, oh, by February 15th, you have to put a $25 deposit. Who are young adults in here? Let me see. Some of you need to put your hands out. Yeah. Yeah. I want to put that too. Good. But, but um, honestly, guys, this is a great time, um, a, a tra transitional time from being a teen, you're in college, and so forth, and then now you got to go into the real world. This is such an important time. Please be a part of this. It's, um, we have to start really, really focusing on how much we need to be in God's Word, especially during that time. Young adults is a crucial time. So, of course, last but not least, Women's Retreat. Yeah. 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 But, amen, the deposit is due by March 15th. All right, get ready. Wait, can someone repeat that March 15th? March 15th. Yeah, because sometimes you say, oh, I didn't know that March 15th, right? So it's a 150 uh, deposit, and the total for it is 295 after. So if you do it now early, it's 275. You save 20 dollars. Amen. What do you want to say, right? Yeah, Amen. It's a discount. Yeah, I just want to say that we're already up to 13 women. There are 35 slots. The little girl was already. Come today after the service, put down the deposit so that you can secure your spot because it's going fast. Amen. Amen. <coughs> Praise the Lord. Amen. Thank you, Carlos. Praise the Lord. How's everybody doing today? Good. Good to see you all of you today in the house of God. Amen. And uh, wanted to just give a quick note. Uh, if you are in Sunday school class and you need to pick up some assignments, go to see Brother Denal. Amen. So Sunday school every morning, every Sunday morning at 9.30 a.m. That'd be great for somebody to get into the work of God. Amen. Pastor yes. Usher and Usher to be able to come forward as we continue to worship the Lord at this time. <coughs> Father, we give you thanks and praise for this is the day that you have made. We will rejoice and be glad. We thank you, Dad. We are managers of what you have entrusted us to distribute, to use for our well-being, for your glory. You own 100%, and you've given us that to manage, to lead with. So, Father, as we present our offering today, we give you thanks to that you have been our provider. Help us to manage those things that are under our care better, including our money. Father, I thank you that we can give unto you and unto your work. We do this in free will offering, more not in the compulsion, but because we love you today. And be glorified through this offering today. In the name of Jesus, I pray.
Dios es grande. Today is part one of a new sermon series uh, called The Fruit 